This is the element that allows us to let go of what no longer serves us, to recycle, renew, and become reborn, striving for resolution of grief, dealing with the cold while establishing boundaries. This meridian runs primarily in the arms, so while working on arm balances, we can also use pranayama, since this is the element related to our lungs. Like always, we want to warm up our body, so begin with a little bit of a sun salutation with major emphasis on the arms. You want to flow through with some chaturangas, hugging the arms into the side body and slowly lifting into upward facing dog. Exhale and push back to downward facing dog. Inhale the right foot to the front and prepare for your ikapada kundanyasan. A slight arm balance as you jump back and lift up into Upward Facing Dog. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Spreading the fingers nice and wide into the mat. Preparing, inhale, exhale lower, and jump the feet back. Inhale, lift to Upward Facing Dog. Exhale back to Downward Facing Dog. When you're ready, you can place your forearms on the mat and work into your dolphin pose and slowly play with hopping up. Again, we want the energy in our arms, in our lung meridian. And if forearm stand isn't in your practice, play with your handstand. You can always use a wall, in my case a fence, and just hop up. You want to find your balance. And once you hop one leg up, see if you can get the other one to follow. Keeping your core engaged, keeping your hands firmly planted in the mat. Keep trying. Never get discouraged. Be in the moment. And eventually, you'll be up. And stand. And slowly make your way down. You can also play with your crow, your bakasana pose, balancing on your arms. And then also your side crow, placing your hands to the side and lifting up. And from there, you can also play further if you like, lifting one leg back and the other one to the front. 